Welcome back everybody to the Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge. I'm Grandmaster Shaman, coming off of a couple of days of absence, but we are back with more Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke. For those of you who have not watched all of the previous episodes, I'd highly recommend you do so because we have gotten to this point with just Cotton Ball and we're going to have to get through the entire mountain with just Cotton Ball. So here's what I did. Um, if you skipped past the training montage or whatever, that's totally fine. But, um, here are my Pokemon. Todd and Max are dead. They're just there for HM capabilities. So it's Cotton Ball, level 75. Now, let me tell you why I got it to level 75. Because it, it, it seems like it's super overleveled. Here was the problem. I'm facing a lot of level 35s through 37s in the cave. And I, not, I can't even do... You know, half of its HP and damage, you know, most of the time when I was in the level 60s. So I decided to put Cotton Ball up to level 75, and I feel like we're still going to struggle uh, as we get up the mountain because we cannot catch, we have no more, uh, real, we have no more routes that we can catch Pokemon on until a after we catch whatever Giratina is going to be randomized to. So that's the problem that we have. I'm going to be able to catch Giratina because we got the Master Ball. There's no really a point because there's no post game that we're going to do in this. Because I'm, I'm, I already know what I'm going to do for the next series. So, Cotton Ball is level 75. And if you also notice during the training montage, I was able to get into Mount Coronet and... Uh, get pretty close to the top. Um, well, I, I at least got right before we started facing Team Galactic, guys. Um, and we're, we're just gonna redo that whole, that whole thing, because, you know, I had to, I had to leave anyway. Yeah, great. You fight wore off at the worst time. Just wasted my life on that. All right. So that that that's I I got I got cotton ball to that point solely on the fact that you know it's gonna be it's gonna be a long long ride. Um. But I get, did get some repels because the fact of the matter is facing Pokemon is a real big waste of power points. And because I only got one Pokemon, that is not a good idea. So, um... Max repels. And because it's level 75, I should not be running into anything, so that's good. Um... This episode's probably just gonna be me climbing this Mount coronet um getting the spear pillar so, uh, i bet you next episode's also going to be me climbing the mountain because we got a lot of team galactic guys that we got to get through so i'm really hoping that i don't need to level up higher than 75 with cotton ball I know that the Elite Four, I don't know how well Cotton Ball is going to do, but I'm, I'm honestly really scared. And because the fact is, Cotton Ball is four times weak to Ice, and it's my only Pokemon. If I face Ice-type Pokemon, I am in huge trouble. So, you'll kind of see what I'm talking about here in a second. Yeah. I... I, I got it up to where that was me facing a lot of, like, the level 37s and stuff. Which is good because the problem is Altaria's attack and defense stat, or attack and special attack stat, are pretty fucking low. They are really bad. Um, the good thing is, I don't think I'll have to be training Altaria for a while. Uh, the bad thing is I don't catch a Pokemon until the end of Distortion World after I have to beat all of Cyrus's Pokemon. And 
based on the previous times I have battled Cyrus, it's going to be really, really hard, especially with one Pokemon. Um... Yeah, double not very effective. Get out of here, Infernape. I, I, I'm honestly just super scared that uh, that we're gonna get into an ice type battle and it's gonna be very difficult to overcome here. I mean, I wish some of these, you know, said that they weren't just Mount Coronet and we could just, you know. Is this the right way? Man, we need the whole Gen 5. Got an HP up. I don't think that's really gonna help much. Shit, I forgot. Yeah, this this is this is where I need to go after. Yeah, I'm gonna go around try to avoid well I mean I guess it doesn't matter but it should be the quicker way all right we're gonna we're gonna battle this guy and then we're gonna call in an episode here what you got team galactic guy three Pokemon I'm gonna speed this motherfucker up Storlax? Shit. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to do this thing. Jump kick. Oh, I one-shotted it off a crit. Oh, I got lucky. Electivire. Headbutt. Yeah. Not surprising that I didn't die to it. Jump kick. KO. Next Pokemon. Like, the fact is, normal normal people should be doing this to these Pokemon. At, like, level 45. So the fact that Cotton Ball is doing this at level 76, like, it's not one-shotting them. That... So... I'd like to thank you all for watching this episode of the Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge. And if you like this episode, please click that thumbs up button. Go back and check out all my other episodes. It has been a crazy ride. I promise you will not regret watching the previous episodes because it is awesome. Now, yeah, so, so go check out those. Go check out my Shaman Vlogs, Raw Reviews, all that stuff. If you want to see something on my channel that's not there yet, all you got to do Go to the comment section. Let me know what you want to see on this channel um, as I'm trying to grow this channel to become very diverse. But right now, I've only got about three things on this channel. So let me know.